What's good, shoot tubers? King Ali back at it once again. I know it's been a little minute. Uh, it definitely feels like it's been a minute. I think the last video I did was the Nike Phone Posit won the All Star '96, and um, haven't really been getting nothing out of stores lately, man. Like I've been getting a lot of like a lot of miscellaneous things. Nothing really worth. I would say, in my opinion, worth doing videos on. So I decided to check my collection, man. It's like, it's crazy. It's like, I got so much content that I could put out, man. I got so many different sneakers, man, that I really haven't seen videos on. So uh, for these next few weeks, man, I'm going to probably be doing maybe one or two videos a day. They kind of show you the other parts of my collection, man. A lot of older models. Uh... All the way back down to like maybe 2010, man. I got a ton of things. So, as you can see, uh, we're looking at the Nike Zoom Flight Bonafide. This is the military blue and white. Really love this shoe. Really love the 95s. The, the Zoom Flight 95 is probably like one of my... I'm going to say it's in the top five. It's in the top five, man. And um, When I first saw the silhouette, I was sold immediately. With a flat and upper, but then when I tried to show them, and I fell in love with it. like these are actually way more comfortable than the uh, uh, original shoe. But yeah, so I'm uh, I'm gonna say these came out like maybe 2017. I want to say uh, they started with like a black and white colorway, which I I hate. I didn't go back and get that original black and white colorway, and then they did a multicolor. They did several colorways. I had the multicolors and I had the red, black, and white one. It was like a true red, like almost like a burgundy, almost. And um, I dogged both of those out, so I still have these. I haven't worn them at all. Still crispy. And um, I have a taupe colorway. It's like a like a purplish. It's like a dark purple and like a light purple. With the white midsole and white bottom. I still have those. I thought I had got rid of those, but I still have them as well. But anyway, uh, this shoe got a lot of a flack, man. These shoes got a lot of flack when they re uh, first released. And I want to say I mostly it was like maybe just... You have to be a fan of the original shoe to really like these. I want to say that much. You have to be a fan of the, the 90s shoe, man. To really like these but i'm gonna tell you like putting these on foot man these like these feel like really really good man especially like with this knit upper then you got like the softer part of the knit that stretches and then you see you got the zipper right here in the background forgive me for the background man it was almost my bedtime and i'm in here like trying to straighten up but this zipper comes down and that's how you get your foot inside the shoe really dope concept and um, I do have the flash on, so this is reflective material that they put on the Nike checks. Oh, but uh, very comfortable shoe, man. If you can find a pair, I know I look for a size 12s like online and eBay and everywhere else, man. I haven't tried stock it. Uh that just came to mind. But if you can't find these in your size, I would say definitely get them if you're just looking for just an overall comfortable shoe to wear. I really love this colorway, man. I'm going to definitely try to find a that shade of blue t-shirt to rock with them. But uh, that's pretty much it, man. You got, and what I love most about it in the heel, if you lift the insole up, you can see the air unit on top of the strobe board. And um, you can't really feel it, but there is a zoom unit. There is a zoom unit in the forefoot, but you can barely feel it. If you take the insole out and feel for it you can feel for it but honestly you won't be able to like feel it upon movement but the insole is really thick and it's comfortable so and you know what it just came to mind i actually paid 39 dollars for these at tj maxx this was a random ass pickup these were at tj maxx around 2018 holiday season i want to say in atlanta and it was just a random thing bro i walked in just to see what was going on man and they had several other shoes on this little table they had or whatever but these were sitting there and you know i almost didn't get them and i'm gonna show you why 
somebody scratched out the 12 and put nine and a half on the box. And for whatever reason, I just decided to open the box and see, you know, like I have a brother that wears nine and a half. So I was like, well, if he wears nine and a half, I'll just get it for him. Retail was 150 and it ended up being the 12, man. So I was really happy about this uh, purchase. I'm going to see if I can find that black and white one, man. Let me see if I can find that black and white one. But that's pretty much it, man. Appreciate you guys watching. Like I said, I will have other videos coming very soon. Uh, I think you guys are going to like what I have to show you. I'm really trying to wait, man. I don't know what's... For whatever reason, man, it's been raining like crazy. And I like to do my videos out in the outside in the sun, man, so you can really get a, a better look at the dimensions or whatnot. I'm hoping this video turns out pretty nice, but... You know, that's pretty much it, man. Nike Zoom flight, uh, Nike Zoom flight bonafide. Go check them out. Check them out on eBay. Look for your size. Uh, tell me what you guys think about these. Like I said, I know a lot of people didn't like this colorway. Well, this shoe overall, but I love them. So, all right, man. I'm up out of here. Peace.